Well, it's it's May 1st. That means it's been one year. Man, why are these pants so hard to put on? Ugh. There we go. Ankles are tight on these ones. It's May 1st. It's been one year of my brain thing. I was hoping that it'd be like, it's been one year. Your subscription has ended. But uh, <laughs> no such luck. I still got this freaking headache, but if you've been watching my vlogs as of late, I've been able to do a lot more thanks to, uh, thanks to meth. Um, but I still got the freaking headache. It just, it just won't go away. Oh, and at the beginning there, I wasn't celebrating one year of headache. That was from my actual birthday. Uh, has it been a couple weeks already? That was for that. Oh, also, I don't do math. <laughs> I take um, Indomethacin. It's got meth in the name. So I, I, <laughs> I call it meth. I also take these. Am amitriptyline and pr pr something else. Uh, they seem to be working good. This is an as-needed or a uh, preventative one, and it, it seems to, to work great. So, if you got a headache like me, take your mess. I feel like I shouldn't have to say this, but don't do math. Here's to one year. I also take, like vitamins and stuff a lot more now too. The vitamin is so good. The one is so gross. Ugh. Ugh. I don't know why they make vitamins taste like this when they can make them taste like these. I always save the good tasting ones for after to get that taste out of my mouth. Ugh. What? Whoever, whoever is making whoever is making the pills that look like like this make them taste good. B50 complex vitamin complex. Ugh. Disgusting. But this one's good. <laughs> I almost, I almost threw up there. I don't get it at all. Want to come outside, dogs? Gina does. Henry, you want to come out? He's like, nah, dude. All right, it's warm out today. And there's Ava. Man, one year. So the pills are just to help with the symptoms. They're not actually gonna solve the problem. Still working on the problem. It's a bummer that uh, it's taking so long. <sighs> I feel like May 1st is like a, it's, it's a bad omen day. Two years ago, Hank dies. One year ago, brain attack thing. <laughs> Whatever you call it. I wonder what this year will bring. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> okay, so today, Ashley went off to work, so I'm gonna let the chickens out for a while here. It's a nice, nice day out. It's plus 27 degrees Celsius today. I don't think it's quite there yet. Come on out, ladies. Come on out. Just got a call from the gallery. That's what that was. That was the, my impression of the phone vibrating. You know what I'm going to do? I'm actually going to replace the actual vibrating with my mouth vibrating. Um, just because it's funny. 
Uh, that was the gallery calling. I got to drop off a couple pieces. They weren't calling for that, but they reminded me of it. They have an upcoming show for another artist, and I'm going to be doing a video for them. I just let the chickens out, but I think I think that's okay. Usually when we leave, uh, we put the chickens back in, you know, in case of hawks and foxes and coyotes and whatever else that might be coming out. Usually that's a worry uh, uh, that uh, we take care of. But now that we got Dix in here, he can take care of that. Uh, I think, I hope. And Melody is here and Landon should be here soon. So I'm gonna chance it. Ashley's gonna be mad at me probably, but uh, and I'll be mad at myself if something happens. But uh, I haven't seen a, a fox or a coyote in the daytime. It's mostly, it's mostly just the, the hawks. What's up, Tina? Billet rub, billet rub, billet rub. Hey, come in the yard for a second. Let's roll. There we go. I don't know if you guys can hear that or not, but there's a siren. The highway is about a half a kilometer that way. And I'm thinking that's a fire truck heading west to the big ass fire that's over there. Yeah, the siren's getting quieter that way. Well, that's no good. Maybe that's what this year is going to be. Imagine the fire just comes all the way east here and burns down. <laughs> Oh man, that would suck. I am not looking for that to happen at all. Okay, so Sean suggests, sorry, okay, this piece and this piece are going to go to the frame shop today. And Sean, who uh, works for the gallery there, he suggested that uh, I put a high gloss on here to make it pop a little better. And it might be more appealing to the client base they're working for. And I, I actually like the idea. I'm not sure why... I didn't put a gloss on there, so I'm going to... Are you kidding me? Shit, 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 shit. No, I need water. I need water. I need water, but I don't think I have any in here anymore. <laughs> ah! Come on. Empty out. Why? Why? There we Damn it. Damn it. I accidentally picked up the wrong can in between coats. And I picked up... Where is it? It said gloss. I was like, perfect. But it says gloss white. And I sprayed it. And I was like, well, this isn't good. <laughs> I can't really wipe it off. I actually like this. But it can't be on his face, so I'm going to have to do a little touch-up now. <laughs> oh my gosh. Hey, sometimes this stuff happens. It's luckily that I know the artist. Is this black? This is black. Otherwise, I'd be pooched. Just going to cover up his 
little white dots in his mouth because it wouldn't make any sense that they would be there in terms of how I've splattered this picture there's no splatters except for pss, that normally i'd put a lot of splatters in like even with the uh post malone here you can see there's lots of splatters so if i got a little bit in his mouth it wouldn't have mattered because there's already some in his mouth and all around but on here no splattering so it makes no sense it'd be there and the environment in which he's singing the light wouldn't sparkly into his mouth I don't think so I'm gonna get it off of here I'll leave some of them just because like it actually looks kind of neat but some I cannot keep it all purple 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 that's blue I'm probably gonna have to mix some purple this is Titan buff, get some of his skin complexion, cheek. Oh yeah, we're fixing it, we're good. Now, the original and the prints are gonna look slightly different now. So whoever buys this original, there is no prints of it, technically. Oh my gosh, okay. That's kind of hilarious. Oh, here's some purple. Iridescent though. I don't want iridescent. I can't believe I did that. Ultra green. Okay, we're gonna make some, some purple, I think. Blue and red. Is this red? That's yellow. I'm glad that it didn't spray out like in a giant. <laughs> that would have sucked. That would have sucked. <laughs> Why don't I have any red? Oh, I do. Right here. There we go. Mix that for a nice purple. By the way, I do not know how to art. I don't know how to mix colors so I get the color that I want or anything like that. I just kind of just do whatever feels good in terms of putting paint on canvas. There we go, that's a good purple. But I do know how to make purple. Oh, that's a pretty good match. That's hilarious that I just did this. I'm gonna add some more in here, too. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, you gonna take me home tonight? Oh, down beside that red fire light. What a dumb mistake, but I uh, I fixed it. It might even be better now. What do you think? This is this is what it used to look like. And this is what it looks like now. Now I don't want to accidentally do the same thing again. <laughs> that would suck. That would definitely suck. <laughs> Oh, it looks like we're running low here. Don't run out, I need you. There we go. I'm liking it. All right, there. It's like nothing happened. This is what it was supposed to look like the whole time. I think it looks good, so I'm not worried. Uh, but unfortunately, <laughs> oh, another phone call, what is this? Well, that was just a waste of time. That was nothing but an interruption. 
but lately I've been answering every phone call I get just in case it's my neurologist or like the pain clinic or something like that because I don't know what their phone numbers are uh, just by looking at it. Uh, so since those would be important phone calls to miss, I just pick up everything. But in this case, it was one of those, you, you know, those annoying congratulations. <laughs> Congratulations, you have won. If you fall for the scam, please enter your credit card information now. <laughs> it was one of those, uh, which is just annoying. But anyway, before I was interrupted, I was about to say that the day has gotten away on me because I screwed up on this. I've eaten up too much time. And so even if I left right now, the frame shop is going to be closed by the time I get there. So I'm going to drop that off tomorrow along with the uh, Post Malone piece. Uh, so instead of doing that today, Landon just got home. Oh, wow. <laughs> I don't know if you're, oh yeah. There we go. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see him, but he's the bright white beacon. He's sitting in the shade now, so you're not gonna be able to see him, but he, he don't got a shirt on. Uh, Landon's gonna drop Melody off uh, in Red Deer, and I think I'm gonna see if I can't go with them because I got something to pick up from our friend Corey. Dang, it's bright in here. I would probably be a bright white beacon too, shirtless. But instead, I got this sick Ushi Tat shirt. You should get one. Link in the description to my Teespring. That was a perfect uh, segue into a plug, wasn't it? What the heck was that? Someone screamed over there. That's the May 1st curse. Landon! The Eastern Beacon! Because he's on the eastern side of the yard. Get it? Uh, so I talked to Corey. He's just going to make it. So, you mind if I go with you? Sick. Thanks for the freezy. Oh, what the heck? Dude, these things always shred your mouth, so I'm always, like, scared of how to open it. I'm like, all right, smile like the Joker to open this. Otherwise, your lips will be ripped off. Like the Joker. How about a lie? Hmm? You want to know how I got these scars? Mr. Freeze! Freeze the fun! Um, I'm, I'm, I'm not sure, but I'll still come in case it is, if you're cool with that. Perfect. Okay, cool. Thanks for the freezy. That freaking melted quick, hey? Okay. Just chatted with Corey. I'm hoping everything works out, but I'm just going to go on the road trip anyway, just in case. We'll see. We'll see. All right, let's see how these chickens are doing. Oh, their door closed somehow. All right, I see plum in here. Where's everybody else? Lock yourself in here. Let's open that back up. Oh, they're under there. Blue and ginger, yeah, it's quite warm out, I bet, is the issue. So they're just trying to stay cool. That makes sense. How you doing, Opal? Oh, she's squatting for him. Oh, he's like, nah. I probably screwed it up by by going, oh, oh. Cock blocked him. All right. No, nope, not gonna happen. 
I'm just gonna make sure that their water is good. Yeah, their water is good. I'll give them some sunflower seeds. The Eastern Beacon. Oh, Henry is gonna wanna play ball. How the heck did he see that ball? Henry wants to play ball with you guys. All right, so let's see how Nugget's doing. Oh, look at this. That's Opal's egg. Oh, look at this. Remember last vlog when we were talking about the chickens bringing the eggs over, but I don't see Nugget in there. Nugget's over here. Do you have any eggs with you? Oh yeah, see look, she's on two eggs right here. And they are very warm, very warm. Hmm. Six, ah, oh, dang it. Five eggs today. I want to leave that in there because chickens like eggs, but if they, well, I don't know how true this is. I wish Ashley was here to confirm, but I've heard that chickens will just peck their own eggs once they figure out that they like them. So I just don't want them to intentionally start breaking all their eggs. That's not necessarily guaranteed to happen or anything, but it could happen. Hey, who wants an egg? Want an egg, dogs? Huh? Here. <laughs> you didn't even try to catch it. <laughs> Oh, there's Archie. I don't know if that's refreshing or not. Egg in the hot sun. <laughs> it's a scorcher out here. You know what I could really go for? Oh, Sandy's in the yard. Hey, Sandy. Could you go for uh, an egg in the scorching hot sun to refresh yourself? That's the uh, the goat people's dog. He's always uh, wandering. It's a really nice dog though. It's, wow, it's a scorcher out here. Let me get a freezy. No, wait, even better? Let's get an egg. Since they're not gonna play ball with you there, Henry, how about this? Probably going to, uh, to, uh, Notice Sandy's right over there. And they might get a little yappy with them. I'm not sure. Oh, he notices them. It's okay, it's okay. Ava doesn't care at all. Oh, Sandy goes into the forest. Oh, look, now he doesn't care. He's like, oh. Gina, you don't even know what you're barking at. Sorry, Ava, I kicked it right in her face. <laughs> it's okay, buddy. He's like, this is my yard, not yours. Get out of here. He's like, wait, where did he go? It's in the gap wing forest. You may have seen Sandy in a vlog or two uh, in the past. He even hung out all day in the shop one time while we were working in there. Uh, working on cutting boards, I believe. Me and Ken, I think? Or maybe me and Mitch, I can't remember. Or maybe it was me and Dakota. Was it me and Jaden? 
some combination of that. Maybe me and Clint. I don't even remember. What the heck was that? Oh, you were sharing. Usually you're a ball hog, but you were like, ah, maybe we can have this or what? What are you thinking? Oh, you want to go see Sandy? We're not going to do that. We're not going to do that. He's like, he, he wants to play, but he's like not too sure. Laving up the rest of that egg there, Cheens. Oh, yeah. It's a pool day for sure. There's a beetle. There's a water beetle, so I guess I didn't have to save him, but. Oh, well, there's a fly. Not a fan of flies. But I'm an even, even more of a not a fan of drowning? That's not how you say that at all. <laughs> Thanks, Ava, for the splash. I'm even less of a fan of drowning. There we go. It's a hot day for playing. <laughs> what the heck is this? Henry's like, yes, I'm going to get two of them. Okay, I'm going to wash up and uh, get ready to go. Do you want to take a ride? I did. You did? Yeah. The last one of the ride. Oh, it's the last one. Last one of the ride. I'll have to cut some more. At least those ones don't taste disgusting. Which ones taste Those freaking the vitamin. Oh, the vitamin. Yeah. Okay. See you later, alligator. I don't know if you guys heard that, but Ashley said, "See ya. Check out the fire. Maybe the May first curse is the fire making its way over here." See you later, Ava girl. No, we don't have any uh, alerts or anything coming up on our phone, so we should be fine. But uh, couldn't see the smoke for the fire yesterday or the day before or the day before. But now we can see smoke. Probably not a great sign. Ashley says the fire is, looks like it's close, but it's still to the to the west. Oh, okay. Out of way. Yeah. I'm thinking uh, it would be cool to do a drive-by, but that's the opposite way of what we're going, so. How far, <laughs> how far is it? She thinks Genesee, but Genesee is like. Well, oh. you check that door. Is that me? No, it's, it's somebody's door. I think you should just turn it. There's no way to do it back on. Oh, okay. Thanks. Now let me close it. Okay. See how much easier that is? Dude, this is a fancy man van. <laughs> Automatic doors? Oh, no. Oh, wait, no. <laughs> no, wait, wait, no, 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 no. It's because there's a bunch of my stuff is by it, so it'll open and. And you've got to push on it as it's getting to. Very fancy man van you got here, Landon. Fancy man van. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna ice cream? Yes. Oh yeah. There's the smoke. That's still far away and it's not black. This place has some of the best ice cream flavors. Now if we look to the west, there's some fire or some smoke visible. 
Yeah, still a ways out and it's whitish gray smoke. So hopefully they're putting it out. Hmm. <laughs> that door sucks. <laughs> it's not as... <laughs> I always think like anything that's controlled by a button is not a luxury. It's a pain in the butt that you pay extra for. <laughs> Like, especially seats. How you can just pull the lever and it goes back in less than a second. Or you can push the button and take a whole minute to get to, get to where you want to be. So annoying. Hello. 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 That's that's hilarious. It actually looks like there's two, one there and one there. Hmm. There's a balloon floating up. You know what I just realized? The Chinese. <laughs> that's probably a weather balloon, because the weather. That's what they want you to believe. Yeah. Do you see the thing dangling from it? Just right, right here. The thing's moving. Yeah, because the, uh, I don't even know if I have it in frame, but the weather station's right here. Right? Yeah. Ah, oh, shit. He's coming here. Watching these guys fight the fires, it's, it's unbelievable. First of all, it's like 85 degrees out without the hill being on fire. And like seven of them walk up this hill. Here I am bragging about doing these stairs up, down, up, down. These guys have like a fucking, you know, 60, 70 pounds worth of equipment, that heavy raincoat, and they're just walking up this hill like it's nothing. They get up there. I notice one guy's got the red helmet. He's leading the way, so evidently he's the fucking chief. So they're standing right next to this wall of fire, and he just kind of, yeah, it's so bad, that, that, and this. And then these fucking guys, they, they just get after it. Two guys have these giant fucking chainsaws. They start cutting away the brush. The other guys are grabbing the brush, throwing it in the opposite direction of the fire. Next thing you know, there's a trail, and they've established a perimeter. You know, and the fire's like, wait a minute, what the f*** happened? I thought everything was all good. And they said, I don't think so, fire. Why don't you just sit there and either go in the other direction over shit you already burned out or just sadly f***ing fade away like a child star. And that's exactly what they did. I watched them save people's houses. They're unbelievable. And it was in that moment that I realized I could never be a firefighter. I don't have what it takes. I don't I have the wrong pigment to be walking up that f***ing hill with all of that shit on, you know? I was joking that night in the comedy club that if I worked in a firehouse, I'd be that guy who stay, hangs back and, like, makes the chili, you know? Everybody calling me a pussy. I'd be sitting there stirring the pot. Hey, be careful out there, guys. I heard it's a hot one. Yeah, f*** you, you fucking goddamn broad. Make me some fucking tuna fish. And I'd sit there with my big fireman red mustache, a little tear in my eye. Sitting there all alone, tasting my chili. Needs paprika. <laughs> so, just got into Red Deer here, and unfortunately, Corey is uh, not going to be able to hand off that thing that I needed him to make. Today, he ran out of time, so I just went on this road trip for no reason. Really? That's okay. Um, just before I started recording, we were stopped there. I was like, I was like, man, I hate red deer lights. And Landon was like, 
I hate red deer. <laughs> Which I thought was hilarious. I was just complaining about the lights. So he's like, ah, the whole town. But look, this red. And then the one after is green, but when this one turns green, that one over there will turn red. Without fail, that's what happens. I hate red deer lights. And red deer. <laughs> okay, green. Right? The other light is green. I need to turn left at this light too, so. Yeah. And there we go. Yellow and red. No one made it through. Even the bike didn't make it through. And there's no one even going this way, so those lights just suck. Just very poorly timed lights. So annoying. Just dropping off Melody. Go, go, man, Van Door. Well, that one works a little better. <laughs> All right, see you, Melody. Bye. That's a flawed design. Why would the door lock? That seems like you could easily lock your keys in the ignition. Let's see, does this door close? <laughs> That door freaking sucks. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. That is freaking hilarious. Not even close. It's the May 1st curse. There's no left. Oh, there we go. Dude, you gotta close the door. I know. Oh, you're gonna do it up there. It, it doesn't work. That's why I had that turned off. Oh, okay. This one just, I cannot get it to shut. It's a, it's a Ford. People will be like, <laughs> fix or repair daily. Yep. <laughs> it's not that bad. I just need a second. Thanks. That, that guy was terrible. <laughs> Wait, how the hell did you do it? Wait, what did that do? Oh, it did. Fancy. <laughs> Is it gonna work? It worked! Got it. Nice. All right, now we're off to your brother's. Bye, love you. She didn't say it back. She did. She said, okay. <laughs> no, she didn't. So we're going to your brother's now? Yeah. Where should actually. And he is in another town? Black Falls. Black Falls. Oh, back the other way. Yeah. Back towards home. Where should I park? We'll park up here. Right in front of the hydrant. What are we doing here? Oh, I'm picking up that check. Oh, just a check. Just picking up money. Yeah. 25 lighters on my dresser. Yes, sir. You know I got to get paid. Landon got paid by the builder of your sister's house yeah. for fixing the stuff that the builder did terribly. Yes. Which is pretty sick. Because we did not want his trades people back in the house right some of them so yeah some of them not everyone sucks but when you when you go with the lowest bid <laughs> as the builder the builder went with the lowest bi bid to uh get his subcontractors and that was who was his brother the tyler was his brother oh it wasn't even the lowest bid it was like the person he knew yep. and then there was also trim work and framing was off yeah. And some other things. It was mainly the bad framing that led to me having to redo hanging doors and redo baseboard and stuff like that. 
trash and stairs. Yeah, and then uh, this brother, or your brother, had issues in his basement because of some sort of leak or something? His uh, frost-free tap to the outside oh, right. froze and burst the pipe. And he was watering his lawn on the weekend and did not realize it. So when one of those bursts, it's a lot of water yeah. coming in for a couple hours. So. Yeah. Yep. Bummer. They're twins. Obviously not identical. They don't even look related, you and your brother. <laughs> I don't, no. I, 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 yeah, I was surprised to learn that you guys were twins. Yeah. I would have been surprised to learn that you guys were just brothers. Yeah, but uh, we have never really looked alike. What about your sister? Do you guys look alike? No. <laughs> my, my brother and my, like, Lance and my older brother... Oh, you look have another a lot brother. Like my dad, okay. I find. Um, but you don't look like your dad. No, I look like there is a picture of uh, like my dad's dad, my grandpa. Uh, so you look like your grandfather. Yes. And I do. your sister, does she look like your your folks at all? I think Trina is more dad's side as well. I don't know, but Lance and and Tyler look a lot like dad. And do they look like each other? Features. Do they look like how me and my brothers look? Like brothers. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. And then there's you. You're and just like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and you were born at the same time as one of them. Yeah. We were actually, mom went into labor with me and Lance three months early at my grandpa's funeral. What? So the stress or something? Wow. Yeah, we were born very premature. Well, there's a tidbit you didn't know about Landon. <laughs> but anyway, oh, good trip. It was, uh, we returned Melody. Returned Melody with no incident for the May 1st curse day. Nothing happened, and it's 10 p.m. Wow, it is still nice and warm out here. So, uh, it looks like... Well, there's still two more hours. <laughs> to be continued. Look at all the eagles. Dang. 